The United States is used to bad winter weather, but this storm has blanketed parts of the country in up to 30 centimetres of snow. And when it's this deep, there's only one thing to do. Break out the shovel and get digging. This is Syracuse in New York State, but the extreme weather has brought disruption right across the country, from the south up to the northeast. Earlier in the week, tornadoes were sparked in Texas, Louisiana, Alabama and Mississippi, cutting power lines and wrecking buildings. 200,000 people were left without power, and emergencies have been declared in two states. We had a most unfortunate event, a uh, storm, a uh, tornado storm, just pretty much ravaged a lot of our industrial community, a lot of our business community, a lot of our residential community. Most of those who died were involved in road accidents, though falling trees also killed some. Now the storm's moved on, and although it's starting to peter out, it still has the potential to bring more misery to residents in New York, New Hampshire, Pennsylvania and Maine, where 15 to 20 centimetres of snow is expected. Eastern Canada is next in the storm's path, but the US shouldn't pack those shovels away just yet. As it moves off, another storm is brewing, making its way up the east coast over the weekend, bringing more fierce weather which means yet more disruption for travellers and businesses over the New Year period. John McManus, BBC News.